Hi guys, welcome here to One Million Fit Yoga. Today I'm gonna to take you through just a basic introductory of downward facing dog. So to start with downward facing dog, you're gonna to come to a tabletop position. Take your hands shoulder width distance apart. Grip the mat with the tips of your fingers. Knees are hip width distance apart. And the knees will stack directly below the hips. To move into downward facing dog, you'll curl your toes under and then slowly lift your hips up towards the ceiling. When you're here, you're gonna take that space between the index finger and the thumb. You're gonna press that area into the mat and send energy up through your wrist to your shoulders to your tailbone. You can then lift up your heels and then slowly melt your heels back towards the ground. Don't worry in the beginning if your heels don't touch. Eventually your hamstrings will open up and that will come. So in downward facing dog, you'll fall through this several times in a yoga class. Downward facing dog, it is a resting pose. So it's somewhere you can come to if you're tired during a class. You can just hang out there for a little bit and meet us back up wherever we are in class. It's a great exercise for your hamstrings and to strengthen and stretch your upper back. 